Okay, so... Sergeant Fans Reveal is a, a very dear friend that I have. You know, there was this time in Brazil that we were all, we, were kind, we kind of all lived in the same neighborhood, but there were different schools. There was Oswaldo always where Sergio from. You had the Carson Gracie guys, you had us. And the rivalry between us was huge. Everybody wanted to be the, the best and compete better and fight. It was a very healthy uh, com competition. And Sergio Payne was one of them. He was a, Osvaldo was a, a star. He, he was a hell of a fighter. He was a he was amazing. So we fought in, in the blue belt, and uh, he won. Uh, both of our fights was won by points. The, the blue belt he won, and then we fought again as purple belt. This time he came. He was up and running. I was the underdog. He was the guy. Oh, Sergio Payne walked in the stadium. Oh, man, oh, Sergio Payne is here. He's going to fight. <clears throat> and it's this photo here. <laughs> uh, he had an amazing setup of arm bar and triangle from the guard. Very difficult to resist. But at the same time, I have a very unique way and effective in guard passing with a stack position holding the, 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 the leg and all that. So he pulled guard and he went exactly for that. And I could see holes on the corner of my eye. You know when your instructor is fighting with you, doing arching and doing the same position. So I looked at him and he was passing the guard with me. I said, man, this guard, I'm, I'm, I, I am going to pass the guard. And I remember in the very last bit, I lost balance a little bit and I went forward. I hit the tip of my head to the floor, but I managed to come back and I passed it. Oh man, it was a beautiful fight. And, and um, Edward Gracie called me that night to congratulate me because they were always there on, on these competitions. There was a lot of pressure because throughout all those years, they always had a panel of tables. You know, like they have nowadays where they do, they have the guys with a computer. Those days, no. It was a, a table and a chair lined up overlooking the, the mass of the people that were fighting. And in these chairs, you had Carlos Gracie sitting down, Eddie Gracie, and uh, Mosul, I think, and some other red belts. Uh, so everybody wanted to do their best because, man, you're fighting and look, look, look who's wanted. Never mind the public. Watching you fight, the creators of the art. Oh man! <laughs> and yeah, so that was a really nice day. We never fought again, but every time I, I haven't been to Vegas uh, that many times. But I went once. Roger had a fight, and um, then we we went back again for the Masters. And every friend of mine that oh I'm going to Vegas. Oh, you gotta go see. Uh, Sergio Payne trained at his gym. He receives us so well. I went to his house. We had meals together. He's a fantastic person, him and his family. And yeah, he's a, he's a really, he's, we, we, we got our belts together, red and black, and now red and white. And hopefully, we're going to still be alive to get our red belts together. Me, him, Jacare, and Max. <laughs> Eight years to go now.